Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, and this video is going to come out very quickly because news has just dropped, NBA 2023 season game release has come out, and also LeBron James extension. I'm going to go through it very quickly. First off, LeBron James. LeBron James has agreed to a two-year, 97 uh, what is it? Two year, ninety seven point one million maximum e extension. He's gonna stay as a Laker. There was rumors of him. Is he gonna go? Is he gonna stay? He's agreed to an extension. He he could tie LeBron to the Lakers too. He could be there. He also also has a player option. So he's there till twenty twenty four twenty twenty five season. Um, that's really the main main news. What this brings is that. The Lakers are going to keep LeBron. I, what's going to happen with Anthony Davis? Is he going to stay? He might. Also, Kevin Durant is still not a Laker. He's not going to be a Laker. Kyrie Irving could be a Laker. Not really. So LeBron's staying as a Laker. If it, Anthony Davis will stay as a Laker. Um, once Scott Anderson comes in, you got got uh, Lonnie Walker, the fifth or fourth, comes in as well from the Spurs. So that's really also what's come just dropped LeBron James two year max extension. Big news for the Lakers having an All Star for an extension there for the next season. Also with the schedule you see in a sec. Also, I think Ben Simmons and the Seventy Sixers have over has settled his over his salary. I don't know what that word is there, but he is seeking to go back. No, sorry, it's not. Ben Simmons was seeking a portion of nearly twenty million that was withheld after he refused to suit up at the Seventy Sixers last season. So I think there's still money at Seventy Sixers that Ben didn't get. So he he doesn't want to return, but he has money there that he didn't get back. That's more about Ben Simmons with his old team grief around that. Um, was number one pick in the Seventy Sixers in twenty sixteen, and became an All Star. Okay. That's also that, but now let's get to the schedule. The 2023 schedule is here. Opening night is what we've got to look at. Opening night, Tuesday, October 18, 76ers at Celtics, 7.30 p.m. And the Lakers at Warriors, 10 p.m. Defending champs also going to be getting their rings pre-game before the game. Championship rings, can't wait for that. Game reviews also will be coming back. Hopefully, not every game, but this game for opening night, I'll probably de definitely do a game review. That's what's happening there. Warriors at home, San Fran, versus the Lakers, LeBron James, Steph Curry, going at it again, same as last year. Championship rings, big crowd there. And they've got the Dallas Mavericks and Phoenix Suns. You've got Boston, 76ers, of course. You've also got... Spurs 76 is a lot of to go and this is also the season calendar October 18 opening night February 17 to 19 NBA All-Star Salt Lake City April 11 to 14 NBA play-in tournament April 15 NBA playoffs begin June 1 NBA finals game that's the Warriors again nah um there's also election day no NBA games will be played on election day so everyone can vote and have a ch chance to vote for the US president of course and Martha Luther and King Day will also be a doubleheader part of Martha Luther and King Day on Monday, Jan 16, with the, between the Hawks and the Heat. Um, that's really this, guys. Guys, thanks for watching. Guys, this video is, guys, the Warriors opening night, championship rings, get them back. A quick video just to show you how good this is. A it's my first ever off-season video under 10 minutes. Pretty proud. Um, NBA TV also to hair. Or to to air 107 games this season. Really good stuff here. So Warriors opening night versus the Lakers at home championship rings. LeBron James extension. More off season stuff to come, guys. Thought to make this video early. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Till next time. Enjoy life and have fun. Peace.